Well, today, former Alaska Governor Palin was on the witness stand today telling a jury about her dismay over a New York Times editorial from 2017 that made a direct link between her political action committee's rhetoric and a mass shooting in Arizona in 2011. That was the one where former Representative Gabby Gifford was shot in the head. Other people there were killed, including a young girl. Uh, Palin said she felt powerless to defend herself against that accusation by the Times that turned out to be false. Uh, so she felt that her only recourse was to file a defamation suit that has now gone to trial. Palin took the stand today and was very calm and cool in her descriptions of her uh, reaction to this Times editorial. Uh, she described herself as the David against their Goliath, uh, this mega media company that has such a big audience. Uh, and again, she felt her only recourse in this was to sue them and seek unspecified damages. It is an uphill battle for her. It's a high bar where uh, the plaintiffs have to prove that there was actual malice in what the, the Times did or extreme recklessness. Uh, an editorial page editor, James Bennett, has testified that he had no intent to try to harm uh, Palin. He's described it as an honest mistake that he regrets. And the Times went to great pains to try to correct it immediately and uh, admit what they were wrong, but again, meant no harm uh, against Palin.